Joining us now in the loft after a long time is the South African First Lady of House. I'm speaking about none other than, can I get a drum roll, please? Hi, what a wonderful <laughs> welcome. Thank you. Well, it is so, so good to have you back. I mean, Tamara, we're it's only... Great to be here. Yeah, I mean, we're seeing you everywhere else. We're seeing you on all the stages. We're seeing you at all of the bars, the discos, <laughs> and all of the parties. You yeah. are creating the holiday vibe. Oh, it's What's festive it been like? out there. It's been so great out there. There's such a beautiful energy. I've been jumping up on, um, on stages in Joburg and, and Cape Town, but the vibe here in Cape Town at the moment is insane. People yeah. are just... I think everyone's like been rebuilding and had like a challenging but good year, yeah. but now everyone's letting their hair down and it's so lovely to see happy people out there enjoying the music and uh, just being entertained and having fun. It's but great. that's what it is about mm. for me. I mean, not only is music just an opportunity to shake your tail further, you mm -hmm. know, get down and get mm. low, but it really is a healing tool. Absolutely. I mean, that's what you say. With yes. your newly defined genre of uh, disco house, yes. you really do believe it has that healing power. Absolutely. Tell us about that. Yeah, um, music is the healer. I think in tough times uh, over, you know, centuries, we've turn to music for that, that release, either to connect with the story and feel connected and uh, not feel like we're alone in whatever we're struggling with, feel like other people understand, other people have been through it. You know, it's, it's storytelling and it's a way to kind of, you know, it brings people together, it brings people into spaces together. It is a, you know, it's, it's unifying, it's healing. Your breakup song, Ultimate One, as well oh. as your, you know, your ultimate pickup song oh, no. while we edit them. Good question. Oh no, oh no. Okay, let me go. Okay, this is <laughs> going to be so embarrassing. Wait. Way back when, when I was very young, uh. <laughs> uh, there was a boys to men song. Oh, it takes Oh no, no, no. I just can't remember what it's called. Oh. Sing it. Sing End it. of the road, maybe? Yes, I think The it collaboration was. with Mariah Carey. Mm -hmm. To the end of the road, to the end. <laughs> oh, my word. Babe, I love that. Take that small, you know, and yeah. then hear it on the radio. Yeah, that was, yeah. you, know, okay. you know, that first crush. Yeah. yeah. That hot bag. Break. What am I that, to do? Is that yours? Yeah. I share. That's it. That's beautiful. What am I to do? So sad. Yeah. But oh. uh, speaking about yes. songs mm. and, and singles, congratulations. You are literally springboarding your brand new baby. And uh, all of our viewers are going to be able to enjoy it. It come <laughs> on. Mm. Tell us all about it. What can we expect? So the first is out, disco therapy. Mm. The second is incredibly special. I I have been a Brenda Fussy fan since I broke into the music industry. Mm. Um, I had the honor of getting to meet her on numerous occasions. She was always incredibly sweet with me. <laughs> Every time she used to see me at an event, she would like call me over and I'd be like, oh my God. <laughs> is Brenda Fussy calling And me? then she'd be like, you need to meet Bongani. <laughs> <laughs> she was like, yes, I promise Kindred you. Kindred spirits. So, so you, funny. You, you could have been her daughter-in-law. Babe, almost. Uh -huh. almost. But almost doesn't, doesn't count. count. That's it. So, <laughs> so she was always very kind to me. And I think, uh, and, uh, and um, she was such a presence. I was at award shows, like being nominated for my first awards. Wow. And she would like pop up on stage, even at the wrong moment as well, just like command the stage yeah. and everyone would be like, ah, it's Brenda, you know, like yeah. she was always like just that character. So um, she, was, she was there, she was very mm. present in my, just as I was breaking out mm. in the music industry. So really, um, you know, a part of that very exciting time in my life. Mm. And I got asked to do a, a tribute show um, I performed a, a, an Yvonne Chaka Chaka song on Komboti nice. and I performed I haven't actually told everyone what the single is. Oh. Uh, yeah, no, 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 I'm, I'm waiting in anticipation. A secret. And I can, you know how she's she's such a good storyteller. Yeah. Yeah. It shows up. that she's a writer. She's yes. building it up and taking this our direction, is, our, our attention in I've a different direction. I've been having people guess what yeah. is the song that I've branded that I'm covering. But anyway, I sang this song, fell in love with it. I've been performing it for the last cheapest, I don't know how many, like mm. 10 years. Uh, only perform it with a band because you can't get a backing track. There's no track for it. Weekend special. It's not. Oh. Yes, I'm so glad you guessed it wrong. Oh. <laughs> I love you, but, but no, it's not weekend special. <laughs> I thought, wait a minute. Mm. Wasn't Brenda stuff from that time, like 70s, 80s? Yeah. 
So I was like, I'm pretty sure I can do it like an Afro disco version of this. That's and a big hint. We've already got now the years it happened. And I've done it. And guys, it's ready I'm so over. excited. Um, but all I can say is, you know, broken promises, eh? Yeah. Mm. Oh. No, no, I'm not saying I know that's the song. I'm not, saying, I'm not saying anything. I'm just saying, yeah, I, like I promise promises. it's going to be a banger. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> I love it. Okay, so all I can tell you out there is that uh, you don't need to be tired of any broken promises because they do turn to lies. But yeah. what you can certainly be sure of is the fact that the music is coming and it's hot yeah. and Tamara mm. is here with us. Let me tell you a secret, Tabzi. Yeah. Now, before we started shooting, uh -huh. I was just like, Tamara, how are you? Long time no see. Uh -huh. Do you remember this? And I pulled up a file. Wow. A receipt. We went back like... 2015 back. Oh, but you were yeah. six years old. <laughs> I was seven. I mean, <laughs> out there. And that is what Where I, were our parents? Where were our parents in hey. that club? Girl. Oh, mama. But one thing that I really appreciate about you, Tamara and Tabzi, <laughs> let, me in on you, let me let you in on a secret. Mm. Who she was back then huh. is who she is today, is who, if you bump into her at the local supermarket, she's still that person. Oh, wow. You are consistent, you, you are love, you are light, you are energy. <laughs> um, I was like a that nobody. A I, was, I was a nobody yeah. back then. Yeah. Asking Bonang Mateba and Tamara Day. We were hanging out all night, so I was like, we might as well get a picture, ladies. They were like, let's go. In fact, Tamara was like, I'll take the phone. And she took the <laughs> selfie, and to this day, wow. I will forever, forever remember, cherish, and value you. Because it just My showed angel. me that you can still be your true, authentic self, always. even in the limelight. I have always, been following always. your journey for the longest time, and I'm so sure so many of our viewers out there watching yeah. right now can say the same. If you were to have one message yes. of thanks, gratitude, encouragement as we yes. exit the festive into a new year, mm -hmm. what would you say to your fans? Yes. My people. <laughs> Number one, um, love yourself, be true to yourself, express yourself freely, mm. love who you want to love unapologetically, mm. you know, do not apologize for who you are. Whatever that looks like, it's beautiful. Mm. Um, we've struggled, we've been through challenges, but the challenges are the very things that make us realize who we really are and what we're really made of. So take that energy, and let's rock 2023. Mm. And uh, promise me, you're gonna go out there and get my new music. Yes. <laughs> uh, and, maybe and I promise you, it's gonna be good. Oh yeah, baby, I love that. Well said, thank you so much, Tamara. Yes. You really are a ray of light. Uh, please do stay tuned because after the break, Tamara is gonna be performing her song, Colors, and gonna be making that ultimate breakfast board. She is gonna love it as much as you are gonna love the brand new music coming out. We'll see you just now.